Today I want to look at a problem I was having with my system tray on Windows 10. Let me focus in on that. So your system tray, if you don't recall or not, is this area. Usually it's next to your clock and it's like this little up carrot, up arrow. And it gives you your, those different system tray things that are on there, which is great. And normally you have it on your main screen. In my case, the main screen is this guy right here. Okay. But what was happening is for some reason, Windows had an update or something and moved the system tray to my secondary monitor over in the corner. All right, and that didn't was kind of an inconvenient spot for me. So I had a lot of problems finding out how to get that thing moved back over. Now you can move your, your taskbar real easy. You can turn it off and on and all that stuff, but I couldn't get the system tray itself to move back over. So let me show you what I did because it was real frustrating and no one seems to have an answer to it. So I did this process and got the system tray back over on the primary monitor. So it's actually pretty simple. So you right click anywhere on your display and we're going to go to display settings, which is on the bottom, near the bottom of the dialog box. So you open up to display and you can see your two monitors and you can identify them as well if you want. And then your monitors will have in the corner one and two. Let me go back. And... So if you identify your monitors, you'll get a monitor, you'll get a big black box with a one and two in them just to double check that you know which monitor is which. All right. So what we're going to do now, we're going to scroll down to multiple displays. Now, what I found was, I don't know if this is the best way to do it, but I went to multiple displays and so it's on extend, which is what I normally would have it. What I did was duplicate this, duplicate the displays. Okay. So I made them both the same. And so I went ahead and kept that change. All right. So they're now they're exactly the same, which is not what you want. But what happened was then when I go back to extend these displays, and keep the changes. The icon came off the secondary monitor. System tray came off the secondary monitor. Okay. And then got back into the correct position over here on my primary monitor. A simple procedure, but gosh, I couldn't find any information on it online anywhere. So that's uh, one way I figured out how to move my system tray. This is not, I'm not talking about the taskbar. I'm talking about the system tray. So just to clarify. All right. Thank you. If you found this video useful, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I uh, just want to thank you very much for watching.